what I'm hearing and seeing is completely alarming. The current situation is dire. Maryland Congressman David Trown and New York Congressman John Kako say while the COVID-19 pandemic rages, so too does the opioid epidemic. No doubt that uh, we were starting to get the opioid crisis somewhat under control and now it's just mushroomed again. Congressman Trone says opioids are ravaging parts of his congressional district. All across Western Maryland, you know, in Washington County, you know, we're up like 46% overdose deaths year to date. And remember, Morgan, that's on top of 2019, a record year of deaths. 71,000 deaths. The American Medical Association says more than 40 states are reporting increases in opioid related deaths. Opioid abuse is on the rise and it, I think it goes hand in glove with the pandemic. Kako says Congress must act and is urging negotiators to reach a deal on more COVID relief to help. We need another round of it. There's just no doubt about it. We've got to spend this money to save lives. Trone agrees more relief for fighting back the pandemic can help Americans struggling with the opioid crisis. It's just an absolute disaster. Uh, so it's crucial that we get this next set of COVID legislation through. Lawmakers in both the House and Senate have yet to agree on another relief package and the clock is ticking as both chambers will recess for the Christmas break in the coming weeks. Reporting in Washington, I'm Morgan Wright.